It's a Sign by Rabbi Stuart Federer of Congregation Sha'ara Shalom in Houston, Texas. You know what this means. There is a child or children who are hearing impaired that live in this area, and they will not hear you honk at them to warn them you are there. It means please be careful and don't put yourself in a position where you're going to have to honk. Slow down. Be especially on guard and look out for children and realize that you are the one who will have to adjust your behavior accordingly since they will not hear you. You know there are always going to be people like that in our lives. They will be deaf to what we say to them. We can honk or warn them of a danger or just give them our advice, but they will not hear us. Either they simply cannot or they are choosing not to. We can keep talking to those who cannot hear us, or we can adjust our behavior accordingly, like slowing down when there are the hearing impaired children nearby. We can try to warn them in a way that they will understand, but we must realize that not everyone will take our advice. And then we have choices. We can get angry at them for ignoring our advice, which will change nothing, or we can be content that we tried and then leave them to their own choices. There is an old saying that you can lead a horse to water, but you cannot make it drink. And that's true. But there is no use getting angry at the horse when he doesn't drink. Maybe the horse is just not thirsty. And those we try to help may not need our help or wish to take our advice. And that's going to have to be okay, too. <laughs> 